Hello, welcome back to my C programming tutorial. Uh, this one is a simple program. Uh, we are going to discuss about a small program and the speciality of this program we are using a function time and this function is used to display the current date and time. So for this program we are using a header file time.s which we have been used in our previous programs I suppose. So we are including time.h it's a header file which is giving the uh, prototypes for this time date functions there is a function called time which can be executed only if we are including this time.h header file and uh, we have the usual stdio.h for printf and conio.h for clr scr and get cs and here we are declaring one variable in this program in the main function we are uh, declaring one variable of some different time it's a kind of variable or it can be a structure to time underscore t and we are declaring an object of time underscore t a variable of time underscore t that is t and CLRS here to clear the screen and this method this function time ampersand t we are using this time underscore t to receive the current time and we are printing the value the current date and time is percentage s percentage s represents string data uh, string data type character formatting c time ampersand t C time returns the current date and time value in a string format. So let us run this program. Current date and time is today's Tuesday, July 28th, and it is 5 o'clock, 10 minutes, and 13 seconds. Year is 2011. This is Indonesian timing. So this is the program uh, time.h. Let us see what are all the function in time.h. The functions are asc time clock c time diff time gm time green which mean time mk time and there are many other uh, methods too and time t this is the one which we have used this variable type defines the value for time functions so if you want to use time functions we have to use this variable type so this is a data type so this is given in times dot s that's what it is given in this help file and c type c time uh, is uh, converts the date and time into ascii ASCII stands for American Standard Code for Information Interchange. This is a standard which is used to represent characters into number format because inside the computer everything is stored in terms of binary numbers or some number format. So basically it is binary number, the numbers of zeros and one. So how to represent these characters A, B, C, D and all in numbers? that standard is defined in ASCII American standard code for information interchange it is it is used for interchanging the information and it is uh, defined by the American standards organization so this C time converts date and time into string it will convert uh, the time into string and we have used another method c time time function so this is a function time function let us see what is this time gets the time of the day the particular time of the day that means it will uh, it will give 
See, uh, time gives the current time in seconds. See, uh, the months, the day and the year. It stores the value in the location. Start timer, provided the timer is not a null pointer. Uh, that means uh, the value will be stored in a pointer in a particular location in the memory. So that's why we have created that variable t and we are using ampersand t ampersand in the sense it is going to be stored the value is going to be stored into the variable t and we are converting this value the value which we have received in the time format to a string data type percentage yes we are using here and it is going to be converted into c time c time is a function which is converting which is used to convert the present time the time variable the value in the time variable into string format okay if you run this program we will get the modified present time this is today's time if you want to use uh, some date or time details in your program then you can use it hope you have enjoyed this video and please try to execute this program by yourself if you have any doubt regarding this program or any other doubts in C programming, please feel free to write to me. This is my email id it underscore teacher1 at yahoo.com. Hope you have enjoyed this video. Have a nice day. Thank you.